My bad. Aiden Damis, I just got your math assignment and you did pretty good today. Yay, thanks! No problem. I should be telling you thank you. This is an A plus right here. Okay class, so please be sure to study your sight words for your big test tomorrow. We have about 10 minutes left of class, so I need you all to complete the assignments and get them to me as soon as possible, okay you guys? So that'll conclude the class. That was the bell. School is officially over. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Everyone who has not submitted your assignments, come up here and submit the assignments now. Here. Oh, thank you, Aiden. Okay. All right, so you didn't get to complete two um, of the questions, so I'll give you more time tomorrow, okay? Okay. All right, awesome. Why are you still here? Do you need anything else? I uh, know, I just um, think do you need any help. Help, um, not at the moment. I just have to grade a couple of assignments. You know you've been asking me this every day after school, Aiden. Is there something you're trying to tell me? No. Is there anything going on at home that I should know? I don't know, it's doing fine. Are you okay at school? Yeah, everything's fine. All right, you know you can talk to me about anything, right Aiden? Okay. All right, so go ahead and pack up your stuff and get ready to head home. Okay. Please, bro. Just tell me he's not really outside this door. All I just want to do is go ahead and piece on my car. That's all I want to do. I'm just pack up. Just pack up my computer real quick. I just hope he doesn't steal all my snacks. I'll just, my mom packed me these strawberries. Kid right there, little wimp, nerd. I hope you don't recognize me if I put my head down. Better have my snacks. Where do you think you're going? Head. You gotta get to me first. Okay. Better have my snacks. <laughs> Where's my snacks? Uh, uh, huh? Just leave me alone. Where's my snacks? My bag. Oh, get it back. Hmm. Some snacks to me. Hey, give me my lunch box. Oh. Back off, it. Wimp. Ah. Back off, Wimp. Scram. Oh. Water. Give me water. Strawberries. Where's the chips? I didn't bring chips today. You better have my chips tomorrow. Okay. Now scram. Have my lunch box? No. Oh, you saw my water bag? This water? Yeah. No! Oh. That's my only water! You can have it now. You're such a bully! And you better have my chips tomorrow. Okay. Scram. Aiden, what's going on? 
fine. You don't look fine? What's going on? Why do you look sad? I'm getting bullied at school. What? Who is bullying you? An eighth grader named Zach. An eighth grader is bullying you? You're only in second grade. What's going on? He took my lunch box. He took your lunch box filled with the goodies that I packed you for school? Yes. He even took my strawberries and water. How long has this been going on? Three months? You've been getting bullied for three months, Aiden? Are you serious? And you didn't say anything about this? Have you spoken to your teacher or anything like that? Or told an adult at school? No. Why not? That's the first thing you should do if somebody's bullying you. What if he beats me up? That should be the least of your concern because you have a mama like me. If this continues, I need you to speak to your teacher. Do you understand me? Okay. And if she doesn't handle it, I will handle it. Okay. Understood? Listen to me, don't let anyone bully you, okay? Don't let no one put fear in your heart and make you too scared to tell an adult what that bully is doing is wrong, okay? Bullying is not okay, you do know that, right? So don't let anyone bully you, you understand me? Yes. School is for learning and to have fun with your friends. If someone is making you uncomfortable, let me know. And let any adult at the school know. They're there to protect you, okay? All right, I love you. Go get ready for dinner. What? I can't believe someone is bullying my baby. Wait till his dad finds out. Babe, can you believe Aiden's being bullied at school? Oh no, he's going to the school tomorrow. He's telling the teacher. And if she doesn't handle it, trust and believe, we will. All right, babe. <laughs> Ain't nobody bullying my baby. <laughs> All right, class. Today is a spelling test, and we're gonna do it with a twist, okay? So you can go ahead and put all your pencils and your books away. This spelling test will be done orally. So this is going to be a verbal spelling test. So a verbal spelling test means that I am going to ask you how to spell it, and instead of writing it down, you will be reading it out loud and spelling out the letters. Do you understand? Yes, Miss Davis. All right, class, that's awesome. So. Clear up your tables. I don't want anything on the table. No cheating, you guys. Let's go, let's get it. You guys have 30 seconds. Let's go, clear up the tables. Clear up the tables. Get my computer. Yes, get rid of everything. I want the table empty for this test. All right, so first spelling word is never. N-E-V-E-R. Awesome job, Aiden. Second word, how do you spell third? That's incorrect, unfortunately, so that's one wrong. All right, Aiden Damis, how do you spell the word girl? G-I-R-L. All right, so question number four, how do you spell the word nurse? N-U-R-S-E. Awesome job, Aiden Damis. How do you spell the word winter? W-I-N for win, and C-T, and C One more try, how do you spell? How do you spell winter? You're going to lose points. Uh -huh. For win and T E R for Carter. Good job. How do you spell her? How do you spell H -E -R. her? Good job. Okay. How do you spell the word the? Love? Yes. Awesome. How do you spell the word book? How do you spell the word book? Awesome job, Aiden Damis. That is a 100% A plus. Oh, you know what? You did get one cor incorrect. So that is actually a 90% on the test. But you did pretty 99. good. 90. Awesome. All right. So class, that's it for today. We are going to resume on Monday. I hope you guys have a great weekend. Don't forget, you do have a weekend packet. I need all your iReadies complete. Do we have an understanding? Yes. yes. Awesome. Do you have any questions or concerns, students? Um, Ms. Davis, do you need any help? Aiden, I'm gonna need you to see me after class, okay? Okay. All right. Aiden, is everything okay? Uh, yeah. I'm very concerned about your behavior lately in the classroom and your academics. Like, you used to be my A1A student. Are, is someone bothering you? Is something troubling you? No. Is everything okay at home? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. You seem like something's bothering you, Aiden. I'm here for you. As your teacher, I'm here to guide you and to 
help protect you along with the other administration in the school. You have a principal, a dean of discipline. If anything's happening to you in school, you are more than welcome to let me know. You know that? All right, so I mean, since you said nothing's bothering you, go ahead and pack up and get ready for dismissal. I'm sorry to tell you the truth. What's going on? You know who um, that, right? Mm -hmm. He's on the the eighth grader? Yeah, he's the one that's bullying me. Zach is bullying you? What is he, what exactly is he doing? He's stealing on my lunch. Why I haven't you told me this? Because if I told you, he said he was going to beat me up after school. Aiden, I'm so sorry to hear that you're going through this. What I'm going to do is, I'm going to actually go speak to the principal and we're going to go ahead and get that taken care of for you, okay? I'm going to contact your mom also, just to let her know what's going on. Is it okay if we circle back on this topic on Monday? Mm-hmm. All right, get ready for dismissal. Go pack your things up. Okay. I hope he doesn't come out. Dad, I told him his name, Sadie. Come on, let's go. Come here, you have to go.